What's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Uh, in the last couple of days, EA Sports has been dropping a lot of info on NBA Live 14. They've been dropping blogs. They've been dropping actual videos. Now, I know a lot of people like, where's all this footage? They have been dropping some of it unlisted. I think they want to get their core fans to notice what's going on. So if you want to know more about NBA Live 14, you have to go to the blogs. You got to be, you know, up on their Twitter and stuff like that. Now, uh, I'm going to give you guys a breakdown of how I like their uh, uh, new dribbling system and a few other additions to the game but um if you guys want to watch this breakdown from the homie scott o'gallagher himself you want to skip to the four minute and 39 second mark of this video and he'll explain you know some of these flicks and the holds to the dribbling now from actually watching this trailer my thoughts are that the dribbling does look good to me um at first in a couple of uh, trailers you you looked at it and you was like ah looks a little off it looks a little slow but you would have to understand that from the aspect that nba live is coming from they want to have more rhythm than anything so they're saying if you spam the right stick you know, just to get your dribble moves off, you know, because we, we all do it in 2K, you know what I'm saying? I will be the first to admit it. When you spam the right stick, you can get a whole bunch of moves off and you can lose your guy. But they're saying in NBA Live 14, if you just don't a whole bunch of moves, guess what? They're going to do what a person does in real life. He's going to sag off and he's going to wait you out and just wait for you to get done your moves. Now, you're looking at some screenshots real quick showing you guys the basic uh, dribble moves and stuff. I just wanted to add these screenshots into this video so a couple people can take actual screenshots on these cell phones or whatever. So when the game drops, they'll be like, oh, all right, bet. I know what I need to do from here on out. Now, the one thing that I do like is the signature dribble moves. Adding in the modifier to do actual signatures for every different type of great ball handler in the league is awesome. Now, this screenshot you guys are looking at is coach options. Now, this is all pregame. This is what some coaches would do up against different defenses. You know, take the Heat, Eric Spolstra. He would just, you know, have people go over ball screens. He on ball pressure and off ball pressure would be auto. You know, their team is good defensively, so they don't have to up the pressure just to win the game. Now, I like the way where um, the Chicago Bulls coach would want to force everyone baseline. Now, I like that. Now, this right here is a nice little screenshot of Endgame where, you know, maybe Kyrie Irving or Chris Paul and all of them guys would be going off. And, you know, you have to make adjustments in game. You can't just come in the game and be like, I'm going to beat this ball just straight off the rip. Nah, not at all. It won't happen in real basketball. Adjustments are what are made in real life. So I'm just liking the way that NBA Live is going into the direction of more simulation. Um, we had said a couple things on the Sim Nation Radio uh, uh, blog talk joint last night, and we were talking about like how EA is going more for simulation and features, you know, and, and letting everybody know like, hey, we're back, we got what you need, come on over here. And 2K is more of like, we gonna get our fans up, and then you know we just gonna blow live out the water because you know our fan base will be bigger. But to tell you the truth, EA has had a core fan base for years and i just feel like you know 2k is like call of duty right now and live may be that battlefield 4 type of feel like you know it doesn't look great but it may play better so we have to see you know when the game drops don't quote me on this i'm just hoping that this game isn't totally ass because yes i have paid my 60 dollars on it i am getting this game and uh you know it's just it is what it is i'm just hoping that I can get the rhythm down to do these moves because of course when I create my point guard I do want to get past my defenders so I'm hoping that you know I can pick some good signatures pick some fast dribbling get the rhythm right just so I could beat guys off the dribble but this is IKC signing out man I hope you guys like my thoughts my little breakdown I'm feeling good about the next gen man I just can't wait till the 15th peace y'all Welcome back live fans, it's Scott O'Gallagher. Here's how you can execute the best moves to break down your defender in NBA Live 14. Let's jump right in. As we discussed before, basic dribble moves are performed by flicking or holding a direction on the right stick. Base moves like hesitations are signaturized as well. Holds are great to use in pick and roll situations while basic flicks are good at keeping your defender off balance. 
take note that this is a rhythm based dribbling system and that spamming the right stick is largely ineffective. As you can see with D Wade, the next step is branching these moves together. Hesitations to crossovers will look and feel differently depending on the player. Timing is imperative in determining your success against your defender. The better you are at comboing these moves together while understanding your player's strengths and weaknesses will ultimately determine your success. The top ball handlers in the league have their own dribble packages. On-ball defenders react differently depending on the ball carrier's attributes. So knowing when to branch out of these moves is crucial. Here is B. Jennings performing the same signature move three times but with three different outcomes. Because of our signature styles, the same dribble input will be unique to each player and yield different results. Control is king, but defense wins championships. Continue reading below for the other side of the ball. Yerp, this is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.